hey y'all here's a quick little video um showing how i do my edible image wraps on my cakes first things first let's measure our cake so we know what size edible images we need to print um so i'm measuring the circumference the height and it's a seven inch cake so the top is going to be seven inches round i want to cover the entire cake so here are my images printed out cut to size let's start first i brush my entire cake with piping gel uh sometimes the piping gel is a bit like thick might not be so easy to um spread so what i did i just added a little water to mine so i i have two separate containers the original container that i bought at the store and then i take a little bit out and i put in a, a separate small container mix it with just water it's gonna be a little globby but just mix it probably let it sit overnight and it'll kind of get watered down this is the version um that i'm using here pipe and gel with a little water so here's my first sheet i line it up with the base of the uh, cake and the cake board smooth it in the middle and then i work one side left side smooth it as good as possible to uh get rid of air bubbles and I wear gloves because you don't really want moisture touching the cake. Make sure your hands or your gloves are dry. And I come to the other side. Smooth it all the way around. So now I'm going to add the other sheet. You can also add a little piping gel right there on the edge of this first sheet. That way the second sheet that you're getting ready to add could adhere to that. You'll see that here. I did it off camera, I'm not sure if I have it, but keep just rubbing, try to get as much air bubbles out. So I'm separating the edible image sheet from the second film. And there you can see, if you look, you can see that little smearing, that's the piping gel. That way that edible sheet could go right over it, smooth it. Now this second sheet, I'm working from the left side, middle, all the way to the right and i'm smoothing it the same way i did the first sheet so smooth 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 but be gentle and these are high quality sheets i find that um it's easier to wrap your cakes when you have like a thicker sturdier high quality edible image sheet um and i'll include information where i get all my material ink printer and edible sheets so you can print your own high quality edible images so here we have a little piece. So I'm measuring it with my measuring tape. And I'm adding it. And I'm smoothing. Smooth, smooth, smooth. So there we have our sides fully wrapped. Quick and easy. Now for this next step, grab some scissors. Um, couldn't find my scissors so i grabbed my son's scissors so but grab some comfortable scissors and we're just going to cut slits at the top um i didn't mention it earlier but basically when i measured the height of my cake i went over a little bit maybe about a half an inch for my edible image just so that i can do this step so um keep that in mind if you want to wrap if you don't want the whole cake fl uh covered in an edible image then you will cut your edible image to the exact height of your cake and only just wrap the sides you don't have to always wrap the top but i purposely wanted the sides and top wrapped so i find this to be the neatest cleanest way to do so so i added my edible glue my piping gel and now those slits that i cut with the scissors i'm pushing those down flat and I only left a little bit, so it, it's kind of like a little slight little struggle trying to get it to stick. But just keep going around, going around. Taking your time, making sure everything sticks. And I want you guys to notice while I'm working, my cake isn't sweating. This is a fondant cake. It's been in the fridge. Um, I covered it with fondant last night. So it's come to temperature. Um, it's not really sweating. 
the as you can see the edible images a lot of people ask me oh does it kind of it's not dripping nothing it's all wrapped up now i add piping gel to the top and i'm going to place that circle and i just use the cake board i use the seven inch uh cake board as my template to cut that circle out all my images were printed on an eight regular eight and a half by eleven standard size edible uh sheet I'm just looking for the uh always find the front of your cake, so I'm looking for a front of my cake where it's even eye levels not going to be lopsided. always do that any cake that you make so now I add my top and I just kind of press it down smooth the ink isn't rubbing off. Nothing sweating. Very high quality uh, edible images. There you go. There you have it. Fully wrapped. The Blue Benjamin Money Cake. Thank you so much for watching.